على الآيات والذكر وفي فيض من العطر هنا رمضان مدرسة تنير مآثر الفكر Every day we will anticipate in hearing the azan and so that we can break our fast. And the best way is by consuming a couple of dates and a couple of glasses of water. Soon as you've done that, you are already hydrating yourself with water and the nutrients in dates, which is a sunnah of Rasulullah sallallahu food, um, is packed with high fiber and minerals which replenishes your food that you have lost throughout the day. But the next thing that I do suggest is that you prepare a soup. A soup is filled with lots of water and is typically made with high fiber vegetables. And so it's packed with lots of minerals and vitamins that replenishes again your, uh, your body. And again, as you have soup um, as your first meal, Instead of indulging into fats and sugars, um, it kind of stabilizes your digestive system and so that you can digest the food much easily. So typically, I would start off in breaking my fast with some water and the dates and followed by a soup. And so today, I will be showing you how to make a very healthy pumpkin soup. Pumpkin is also a sunnah to Rasulullah food. Um, this is easy to prepare and you can make a big batch and which you can eat for the next few days. What we're going to start off with is I've got some bell peppers, so some yellow, green and some red and I'm going to put it onto a, a roasting dish. I'm going to drizzle some olive oil and I'm going to season it with salt, some pepper, and some paprika. I've got some Spanish smoked paprika because I just like the earthiness of it and it just gives another dimension um, of flavor. So you just season that all together. And I've got some vegetable spice, which I'm going to put over. And basically this goes into the oven for around 20 minutes to roast up. While the peppers are roasting, I am now going to saute some onions um, in my pot over here. Now pumpkin is not only a sunnah or a cereal food, but it is a low GI food and so it releases energy um, easily. So pumpkin not only is a fantastic food to have, but having it in a form of a soup, you are not only replenishing all your nutrients and hydrating yourself as well with lots of water and fluid, and it just kind of prepares the stomach from adding in food into your diet again. So I'm going to literally just saute the onion until it softens. I added just a little bit of olive oil and just going to wait until the onions go translucent. The onions have softened up and I'm going to now add in my chopped pumpkin. And I'm going to add in some chili flakes. I'm going to add in some Himalayan sea salt, which is also similar to Rasulullah, and some black pepper. Mix that all up together. And I'm going to add in my vegetable stock. So I've got two cubes of vegetable stock, which I've diluted into a liter and a half of water. And you just cover it, cover the sweet, but uh, the pumpkin up and you let it cook and let it become soft. around 40 minutes. 
the pumpkin has been on the stove for around 25 minutes and has become soft. The peppers have been roasting in the oven and they're done. And all I'm going to do is add in the mixed bell peppers into my soup or pumpkin. Okay, once all of that is in, we're going to take a blender. I'm going to use my Braun Multiquick 9 and you're just going to blitz everything together. Once it's blended, you'll see you have this beautiful velvety soup that is just amazingly Moorish and delicious to have. Okay, gonna take this back onto the stove just for a few minutes. Gonna add in some sweet corn and some broletti beans. Let that just cook together for a few minutes and then we'll serve up with a dash of creme fraiche and some parsley on top. The soup is back onto the stove for a few minutes. Now I'm gonna add in some broletti beans. It's entirely up to you how many you want to put. I'm actually not gonna put all of them in, I'm gonna put half. And you're gonna put some sweet corn in. And you're just gonna wait until this comes up to a boil again. Literally a few minutes and it's ready to serve. Here we have our first recipe of the month, a deliciously Moorish pumpkin soup. All it now needs is a do dollop of creme fraiche and some parsley on the top. This is a great way of breaking your fast after the date, replenishes your salts and your minerals, pumpkin, a Sunnah Rasulullah food packed with beans and sweet corn and chili flakes. It's delicious, it's hearty, it's fulfilling. With a homemade bridge, which I will be showing you tomorrow, it goes perfectly well together. So stay tuned this whole month of simple, healthy, balanced iftar. Shaz eats, Ramadan eats. See you tomorrow. الآيات والذكر وفي فيض من العطر هنا رمضان مدرسة تنير مآثر الفكر على الآيات والذكر وفي فيض من العطر هنا رمضان مدرسة تنير مآثر الفكر